Right, hiya guys, welcome to episode 18 of the Birch. Um, it's the 3rd of January. It's the first session now of uh, 2013. Come down back on Ice Bank on the peg I was on last session. The fish are still holding up here. Um, come down nice and early now. I got down, I got at the lake, uh, I turned up for 7 o'clock. It's just coming up to, uh, just coming up to 5 to 8 now. I got all the rods out. Got all my kits sorted. I'm only doing a day session today. I'm going to uh, probably fish till about 6, 6, 7 o'clock tonight. For a quick 12 hour session. The moon's still out. Don't know if you can see it there. But the moon's still out. The rods are out. Hopefully the carp are still in the zone. They've been coming out of uh, they've been coming out on this uh, side of the lake now the last the last week or so so uh, yeah hopefully they're still here and hopefully we we'll get a fish fishing KD rigs Martin's uh, winter bottom blend winter uh, winter blend bottom baits yep all looking good Matt and uh, Matt and Carl's just turned up now they're doing a day session as well today they're just having a little scan around the lake now see if they can. Uh, See if they can find some fish, but um, yeah, that's about it for now. So uh, I shall see you soon. Little update, guys. Just coming up to line nine o'clock now. Um, I haven't had no runs or no beeps or nothing yet, but um, I've seen a fish. I've seen a fish in the zone. I'm not sure if it was a pike though. It's just like a little, um, a bit of a ripple in the water, a bit of a splash and a ripple like I've just seen here to the corner of my eye. But, um, yeah, Cal's just to the right of me. Got Matt just to the left as well now. So, um, yeah, one of us should, should get a fish today. It looks good. Got this southwesterly, uh, southwesterly wind blowing in as well. So, it's happy days. I'm donning the new, um, the new avid cap um, winter hat as well. Check this out, guys. There she is. Here's a bad boy. Old Christmas present. Avid cab. Gotta say, very, very good. Warm as, uh, warm as toast. Fair play. Keeps your old, keeps your, keeps your old body warm. Just wearing a hat. Right then, guys. I'll get back to you in a bit. Right, quick update, guys. Just had a uh, just had a screamer on the left hand rod. Struck into it. Nothing was there, though. So I don't know if it was a liner or what, but it was out of, it was out of a screamer. It's a patch of weed just in front of the rod. Tips look and uh, could have been a pike, you know, because the pike pike are uh, active now this time of year. Could have been a pike just swimming past, caught the line on one of his fins or something, and dragged the line for a bit. But uh, yeah, that rod's gone back out now. That's going towards the corner of the island out there, and um, just seen a nice, a nice. Well, it was a chunk, actually, proper chunk. Just showed mid water off Paul's post, big, huge, massive black mirror, and um, yeah. And hopefully, because this wind's blowing this way as well, it should, should, should push the fish, you know, in, in, into this area. Hopefully, that's the first, that's the first proper show I've seen you now. Proper came out of the water, a good, a good two foot as well, you know, crash. But, uh, yep, still no fish to report at the moment, so I'll, uh, I'll check the swans out. I'll get back to you soon, guys. Just coming up to two o'clock, guys. No joy, no joy at all. 
No one's had nothing here on her um, house banger now today. So I got Carl to the right, I got my mate Bushy to the left and then Matt to the left of him then. John's just turned up as well with Tom. They're doing an, um they're doing a twenty four hour. They're on uh, the fallen tree. It's just setting up over there now. But um Yeah. Still a couple of hours yet, uh, left yet though, so still hopeful, still positive. Get back to you in a bit guys. And here we all are. Fuck. The last the last dying hour. We got Matt. Matt the bailiff. We got Bushy. Bushy in there. Looks like the Taliban. <laughs> with all that on his face. And then we got Carl. Sat there chilling. What are you eating, Carl? <laughs> Biscuits. Oh, where's John Wood? He'd be lurking. He'd be lurking somewhere, he will. He'd be like a little rat. He could smell it. you smell that food now from the seawall. <laughs> Chuck it on the floor. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. Happy days on the birch. Right guys, just coming up to 4 o'clock now, just starting to lose the last bit of light. Probably got a half hour of light left. Gonna leave the rods out till, um, till about 6 o'clock, fish in the dark for an hour or two. And see if we can pick up a fish just as it goes dark, like, you know, because uh, no one's had a bite here for the day now. A couple of anglers have turned up. There's um, Dennis up on the uh, up on the top singlet over there. Uh, there's two boys over on the 83, both pegs over on here, someone on Paul's post. And uh, you've got the sea wall as well, that's pretty jammo. You've got John and um, you've got John and Tom over there, and you've got Wonky Taff as well in the um, no cap corner. So yeah, it's quite packed actually, so... You know, that might have had something to do with the fishing today. You know, the amount of lines in the water, the pressure. Plus this, this bank, house bank, has been bashed now since, the, you know, for the last... The last two weeks now since I had that um, since I had that big hit of fish here has been bashed over here. Like you know, everybody's been coming over here and um, fishing this side of the uh, lake. So I think they've moved up, moved you know they've moved back up towards the um, the top single you know towards Paul's post top single that that kind of direction. I think they've moved up into. So um, yeah, I'm gonna blog out now. Sorry there was no fish on this session, but uh, I'll, try and, I'll try and get one on the next. I'll see you soon, guys.